Those of you that are tuning in live on Facebook, thanks for being here with us. Thanks to Jeffy's Fab Farm for giving us a taste of the action here at River City Rampage, day number two. If you like what you're seeing, make sure you're joining us for the rest of the evening on DerbyNation.tv. We've still got Mini Madness feature, an old iron feature, and the 80s and newer feature to come after this. And if you get the multi-pass ticket, you can pick up everything you missed uh, this weekend already, including the consolation, which happened at noon today, and all of the qualifying heats yesterday. Drivers in this class are aged 10 to 14 years old. Once again, the 19 of Bailey Booper Everly. 70 of Brooklyn Patton, DF7 Dylan Fisher, EF7 Ethan Fisher, X23 Hunter Huntman Sarver, 3.5 Jacob Jitterbug here, 205 Jalen Dunn, 13 Junior Jordan Adams Crafton, 05 Carson Manuel, 6B Salina Breckenridge, looks like the 4S or could be the 9S Sydney Samick. 67 senior Logan Moss. Pink 03 is Abby Maliere. 62B Braden DeBates. And 56K Cody Mongan. Here we go for the first time tonight. Officials are ready all the way around the track. Countdown for the first time tonight. Here we go. Hard shot from the PC Cruiser right off the bat. Pink 03 right there. Those are pretty tough, but their spindles are not so great in front of those things. You have to change them out to something else. Oh, big shot there on the 4S. Looks like a driver's door contact. Door is caved in pretty good. Flag on the track. Stop it for a bumper. Shameless welding red flag here for this bumper. Jordan Crafton in the 13 junior there, the black uh, PT Cruiser. Facebook free preview brought to you by Jeffy's Fab Farm. Impact Derby Products track side cam shows you this action up close. Red flag. 
Get a tire off, get a bumper on the track. couple of officials talking to the 205. That'd be Jalen Dunn. And looks like everything's all right there. Most of the pack piled in down here on this left-hand side of the track. A few of them over on the right-hand side. GH Graphics red flag for the bumper and the tire. Officials are getting back into position here. I've got green all the way around. Three, two, one. Three, three, three. Get back at it. Nineteen was kind of dead in the water there, trying to get refired. Bailey Duper Everly. Patton in the 70 here. Doesn't even have a scratch on the car yet. Three and a half working on the front of the HHR, the pink 03 of Marlier. That's Abby, she's trying to get going. Ooh, nice nose to nose shot there. NLR Derby Parts, red flag here. Oh, it was a 206, not the 205. Sorry about that. Jalen Dunn. I remember being that flexible. It's been a long time being able to just climb out the window like that so easily, even even though she's needing some help here. Looks like she's got a little, maybe something with her, her leg or her foot. Bumper boy helping out. Got it right to a cart. at it. Good shot on the three and a half.
good shot on the driver's front wheel of the 70. Ooh, nice shot. F7. Ethan doing some damage. And it looks like my driver's list was written a little Messily, so the DF7 is Dylan Fistler, and the EF7 is Ethan Fistler. Those would be Jack Fistler's boys. Crafton with a good shot in the 13, may have taken himself out in that shot. Killer custom dirty parts and transmissions, red flag. Ah, I got somebody's rear tire set up. left we come back to green looks like Jordan Adams crafting looks like may have started and stalled again car rocked forward and died down to about seven or eight cars. Fifty-six K of Manga. Cody Manga with a good shot. That wheel's bent over pretty bad. It's only a matter of time for that axle. Let's go. Solid shot back to back with the 70, the EF7. Mm -hmm. 62B. Taking a good wheel shot there. Braden debates the 62B. Big shot on the zero five. Carson Manuel on the zero five. Oh my goodness, that was a hard shot. Dylan in the DF seven.
Longer than the 56K. Trying to put Dylan up onto the barrier. Couldn't get, couldn't get him there. Dylan Fistler both still running. Logan Moss looking good. 60-17. That shot might have taken him out right there. He pretty much hit with his driver's front tire. Down the top five. 56K out with a fire. Shambles welding red flag. He's a little disappointed. Let's see what is left moving. There's, there should be five cars left when we go back to green. Fire's out. Everybody's in the money right now. I'm looking for green all the way around. I got green all the way around. Three, two, one. Green, green, green. Here we go. Trying to get her fired up. Ethan Fissler and the EF7 on the clock. Carson Manuel in the 05 still out there rolling. The 67 senior Logan Moss. Dylan Fistler in the DF7 still rolling. Patton in the 70. Been putting shots on the EF7, but they're on the clock. Oh, good shot there. Nose to nose. Ethan goes out in fifth. Impact Derby Products track side cam. of Moss could be all done. All right, we're all back there. 67's on the clock. We need to get required. A lot of fluids out of the 67. Watch, watch the driver's door. I want to remind you of those of you that are watching on Facebook, say thanks to Jeffy's Fab Farm for sponsoring a live look in, giving you a taste of the action here at River City Rampage, day number two. If you like what you're seeing, there's still a Mini Madness feature, an old iron feature with full frame Imperials and uh, the 80s and newer $10,000 to win main event still coming up. You can watch it all on DerbyNation.tv. Just a reminder too that uh, DerbyTees.com is having a sale this weekend. You can 
to celebrate having a hometown derby. You can go on derbytees.com and get your order ready. You can enter in promo code RCR20 and save 20% on your order. Carson Manuel in the 0 5. Pushing on the 70. Now looks like having some issues. Gets it to back away. Something's gone wrong with the 70 now. That's Brooklyn Patton. DF7 and Dylan Fistler went out in third. Good contact was made. 70's time is winding down. That's going to be it right there. Time's up. Yeah, I'm going to run up there, I think. How you doing? Good. Carson, right? Yes. Carson Manuel, congratulations. That was a really uh, fun looking run. Looks like you had a good time. Yes, it was. So tell us about the car. What'd you bring? I brought a Lumina. That's pretty much the car choice in these compact classes. How long have you been doing it? Is this your first time? It's my first time. Right. So first time, first win? Yep. Who was with you? My dad. Did, uh, did he help you at all or was it mostly you? He kind of helped me. Yeah. What, what was going on there at the end? You guys were sort of... You were making some shots on the side and trying to decide whether it they were done dying. or not. It kept dying on me, so it just wouldn't start real well. Okay. Any sponsors? Anybody help you out? I want to thank Justice Graphics for the stickers and my dad for helping me build it. That's perfect. All right, congratulations. Nice job. Carson Manuel getting the win here in the youth division. Let's see if we can catch a second place driver. Fans, this is Brooklyn Patton, driver of the number 70. You finished second. That was a pretty good run. I guess so, yeah. I guess you could say. It looked like you were having fun out there. You made some pretty hard shots back to back with some of these cars. Yeah, I was a little nervous, but I guess I, yeah. First time? Uh, no, I ran in Rushville in Indiana. Okay. So this is my second time. Second time. Not so bad. Thank you. 
Anybody you want to say thanks to? Um, yeah, Morgan Brown and Ashley Bray, and then my dad for helping me. What happened at the end here? Uh, my battery cable came off and I didn't notice. Oh, it's always the worst. Yeah. Well, now you get that stuff out of the way and it'll be a lot easier the next time. Yeah. All right, congratulations. Nice job. Thank you. Thanks very much. <laughs> Number 70, getting it done in second place. So close, just couldn't quite get there. Fans, we still got more to come. Mini Madness coming up next. Old Iron, and then, of course, the 80s and newer $10,000 to win feature. Hang out here with us here on DerbyNation.tv. Fans on Facebook, if you liked what you saw, join us on DerbyNation.tv. Get your ticket. That's going to do it for us on Facebook, and thanks to Jeffy's Fab Farm.